Welcome to another journey, and welcome back to the final episode, I'm pretty sure, of Spy Kyoshitsu, episode 12. Let's get right into it. One, two, three. Let me just set this properly. One, two, three, go! Oh, one, five. Oh. So, what are we? What, what's happening this episode? Oh, right. Lily and, um, Sylvie already left. <laughs> they gone. They out of here. Are we going to get like a flashback of like what happened? Cuz that's that's doing them dirty. Monica and the other gang. <laughs> but we're still on great man. Oh. Ooh. Several weeks later, oh, weeks ago, my bad, after the first mission. Damn! So, great, great, wow, great, they just. Oh. Oh, were they gonna get something for him? <laughs> oh, right, on what they were planning on doing? Oh, like the young, like the first, not the first, but the young, younger girls. <laughs> Where are you going, Lily? Uh huh. Oh. Regret <laughs> is like the only one who's sad. <laughs> oh. This is nice. Oh. <laughs> they, are they gonna have like, oh, so that's what. Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> that's cute. Was it closed? Oh, it's closed. Oh. <gasps> no! Oh. Is someone sta sabotaging the area? How the fuck you know that too? Oh my God. See what? Hmm. Oh. Is someone trying to buy up this area? They're trying to find this, buy this plot of land or something, right? Yeah, they're sabotaging the place. Do I just like it's a good <laughs> Yeah, there we go. They're trying to license the thing. Mmm. They're trying to patent not even patent, just take the whole thing. Yep, there we go. Oh, But not at a pity price like that. Aww. That is true. That is true. Ah, oh, because he doesn't have someone to put. Oh. Oh man. Adopt. <laughs> Adopt. <laughs> hmm. Please. So yeah, Mon. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god! Oh, they're gonna help. <laughs> I love them. They're on the same. They're yes. Ah, beat up. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Poison beat up. Ah. Mm. Is that where Greta comes in? Hmm. Oh. Oh, so this so this is why the meat pie is very Huh. Well, now they know what they're gonna do for ten. Oh, so th is this? <laughs> oh, <laughs> so this was what they were doing for the day. Hey, of course, she would go here. Oh, stop! It's probably like a higher up or something. There we go. Ah. Oh. I don't know what she said. So it, her skill is like surveillance or like just tech related, right? Oh, so they're doing the dirty works, yeah. For self defense? Yeah, he's using violence, brute force, huh? Why are you gonna do me dirty like that and play the opening like that? Wow. Lily. So she's gonna sell. Uh, huh. <laughs> That's nice. Was that edited? Oh no, I think someone did Monica take the photo? Oh. What was the price? Mm. Only three months. <sighs> Who are you disguising as? Oh. What's happening? Ha! <laughs> no, nothing. <laughs> yeah, 
Oh, there we go. Great, huh? Wow! I thought she couldn't. Huh. Interesting. And this was weeks before their mission that they had. Uh huh. Hey! Your leg! I mean, your. your uh, uh. There we go. Oh, so she actually just forged. Okay. Bad luck. Please. Oh, is that why she did that? Wait, no, this is no, this is something else compared to the first one, right? Well, here he is. Ah, oh, so that's why she can do the disguise, but not the up to the void and stuff, huh? Wow. <laughs> Yo, the freaking people, the Trump, the trumpets, they're going insane. Whoop. Oh! 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 <laughs> Lily! Oh! Yeah, see, stage one. So what now? What happened? Wow. <laughs> huh. But that doesn't change the fact that the guy is still thinking. Of... So is this their way of like trying to. Wow. Is that like the. Did he offer you like a free pie? Oh, with the boss. When? But it's not the same. Ooh, even something that he couldn't do. Mm. See, yeah, I was about to say, it's like, it's the love that you need to put. Man. <laughs> I ship y'all too. It's fine. Hmm. Oh, oh, so that's why she's working hard for this. I feel like in in the current timeline after that mission he he probably has like a what do you call it mm. oh. to stay put oh yeah pretty much I mean It's to keep peace. They're literally getting harassed. Come on.
Did he offer more? Yeah, I know he's offering more. <laughs> it bumped up the price, yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> huh. <laughs> Yo, Grete. <laughs> You gonna ask him for the recipe? Where are you? Oh. Oh. Did you get all of that? Oh, the suitable amounts of each. that is so it's gonna it's gonna take a lot more long yeah I was wondering is like did you get all of what he said I'm like what I forgot that Klaus is horrible at teaching I mean it was a good thought but we gotta remember that this guy is not good at teaching hmm Bankai? <laughs> Bankai? <laughs> Gotta need they ugh. Oh What's your name? Oh, poison. Oh. Oh. See, he got someone. He got someone. <gasps> Let's go. He probably got inspired by what they said. Oh, 
Merci. Oh, Claude. So they can take that. Oh, great. Of course, they're like family. Oh. <laughs> uh, they're supporting you, let's be honest. Ah. <laughs> He's like, nah, I don't. See? Tomoshibi? Yeah. Really? <laughs> Ooh, never mind. I take it back. Hello? Huh. Mm -hmm. Is she like the fan, like, is she a fan favorite? Like, what's up? She had so many episodes. <laughs> you were dedicated to her. Oh, damn! I do feel like the anime... I do... No, not, not just the anime community. It's just in general. Itomiku is really going out there lately. And she's in a lot. This is Itomiku. This is Kokoro, everybody! Ooh! Mm. Hey, hey, hey. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah, they have a lot. No, there has to be a season two, no? Mm -hmm. Ooh! This is a whole different person. I swear. Voice actresses. Voice actresses and actors, they always be confusing me. They get surprising me above and beyond. What up? They're still not here. Oh, we can get season two? <laughs> oh? Is it the other people? Like the, the, the enemy spies? Come on, we got, we got like in... I thought they want to play the open, uh, the ending. Where are they? What happened? Bro, Onessa! Is it Monica? Wait. What are you. Whoa! What the fuck? Huh? Is this why they were not focusing on these two? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my, oh my god! What? <laughs> what? Sons of bitches! <laughs> oh, actual, what the fuck? Huh? Huh? <coughs> oh god. <laughs> what is going on? What? What the fuck is actually going on? Is there like, wait, what's, what's the news? <laughs> Boy, let me, hit me up with the news. There has to be something. Ah, let's see. Uh, nothing, nothing at all. I, uh, I'm i trying to think of what, I mean, there has to be, unless it, be it like a special episode or like, like a special few episodes to have like a final, final thing. Okay, see, th this is why I was always wondering, like, what the fuck is exactly happening here? Gets, you know, oh, 
I saw like a Gundam thing. Um, no, because it does. It honestly did not make sense with how they kept on not focusing on the two there. Oh, Bofuri. Oh, the episodes are delayed. Okay, episode eleven, twelve. Okay, that means I can I can I can rest. <laughs> um, is that it? Is really? season no that's bro I'm not talking about assassination classroom god damn it is yet to be announced yeah it's yet to be announced because there's no news about it so far but it does feel like there would be like a second season uh, has not yet been publicly confirmed to be in development so what does the future hold yeah, see, the, the, uh, this is why I hate searching for, like, season two or, like, some other series and, like, the next season. Because then it never, they always, this is why I hate, like, the fake news thing is still not as, it's still there. It's, it's, it's there when you, when you see it, but, like, it's, it's just so annoying at this point. Like, really? Goddamn. Why, why go this far? Like, just give me what I want at this point. Why you gotta be like this? Why are there pots for the manga? What is this? Nah, I... There has to be, like, some other extra pots or something like this. This this is ridiculous. This, if they really did end it like this, and they're like, there's no announcement whatsoever, that, that's, this is, this is bad. Like, this is actually really bad when it comes to the whole thing. First off, like, the pace, not even the pace, the pacing was okay, but the order of like the whole time if is this what it was like in the in the light novel <sighs> like it's not like, i'm gonna be honest it's not confusing it's not confusing i'm not i'm not mad about like how it's like how they like ordered it it's just that i don't know i have bad PTSD from um, Peach Boy Riverside. At least this one, they show like where about in the timeline we we are at. I feel like this was what it was like in the light novel. Although it's a bit, uh, I don't know. I there has to be a second season. I feel like it it wouldn't make sense with how they ended this episode like that. This is supposed to be the final episode too. So this just doesn't make sense. Unless they... It's either... It doesn't have to be, like, a second season. It, at best, like... An extra... Like... But if, if they do it, like, Wonder Egg Priority, I might actually just give up at this point. Because that... The way that they ended that series was just so... For a series that was building up so much tension. At the last... What was it? 40 minutes? Or at the 40 minute finale of that series it just went it was all the way up there and it just plummeted down into the ground on into the goddamn earth's core i hope this doesn't become a become the case of that too because this is slowly becoming something like that like you can see that the pacing wise i honestly i don't know i don't know how it's been paced out it does seem like they rushed a lot <laughs> I don't know. It always feels like they rush some parts of it. I still want to know more about Monica and Thea. Thea, was it? Because those... And now they show that at the end. Now I want to know more. So I'm not going to give a score for this one. Because it's... it's it, it feels incomplete. Like, there, there's obviously something else here. But let's say if it was just this alone. I re, I'm going to be honest. I really like the plot twist. The music opening and ending, like the official ending, like the insert songs were good too. But the end, opening and ending were just top notch. So I, I got to give it high points for that. It's getting a passing point. Like it's going to get above five. But, and like just from the plot, to, like the plot twists were fucking mind, it's mind, mind blowing levels. The way that they kind of like revealed everything and the fact that they actually gave hints to it. So it's not like, you didn't see it's not like you wouldn't have seen it coming they gave proper hints it's just that they wanted you to focus and be like oh this is what they fucking did you should have noticed kind of kind of crap also i'm actually surprised that because wasn't 
going back to the meat pie recipe thing, wasn't the bargain that, or was that just taken out? He was just selling the recipe so that you can sell it as well. But, um, whatchamacallit, you can sell the recipe with that being the case, but, uh, what, what was it, what was I going to say? But yeah, yeah, his, his condition was that, see, so this is, this is, I'm guessing this was from his previous condition where he was paying all of that, but you cannot sell it yourself. So he, so he was getting um, exclusive ownership of it, but I guess he took that out and raised the price because of that um, chef guy. So maybe that's why he can sell it regardless. Hmm. I guess. That, that's like the only thing I can think about when it comes to that. Because I was still wondering how he was still able to sell the meat pie when the guy like stated that specific condition. But I guess that's how they changed it up because the guy previously was like, he's just buying the recipe for that price. So if he wants to get that bargain, he'll, ha pro he'll have to like raise it up and get rid of that condition where you're not allowed to sell the meat pies. You know so yeah there's there's that going on there and um so ultimately <sighs> score wise uh i I'm, I'm not gonna lie the the grete like plot twist there was fucking insane that was like br that was just mind blowing i love it when series are able to like shock me confuse me get me off guard at my I don't know at my at, at at the most unexpected moments you know so the, I barely enjoyed this and that alone would give it like I would give that just from that I would give it like a f actually no song and open song like the song opening ending and like all the insert songs from Edna Sylvia I don't I don't think Lily had it Grete had it I think but did Lily I feel like did Lily have it no see I, I forgot to check it again last time as well I don't think Lily had an insert song questionable I'll, I don't know I'm not 100% sure anyways um so like song wise it's it's just great all the old voice actors all good as well it did go by a lot faster it like now I'm oh and Sarah also had her insert song right 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 but any, anyways you, you get what I'm trying to say um so I at least enjoyed that they like went through as you would expect they would go through each of each of the characters give them their own backstory and like we'll go through whatever issue that they're having Grete was very long I was I'm just wondering is she like is she like a potential like like a fan favorite of some sort or like not even fan favorite like is it the creator's favorite like they're wanting Grete to like um, for her love line or like her love interest aka Klaus to like reciprocate her feelings like something something some kind of favoritism situation is going on like because that was so I know I guess it would be considered like the like the arc after like the whole situation but they I thought they would at least cover like more people but they just recovered the ones from before which was Sylvia, Lily, and Sara. And then now they ended off with Monica and Tia being like that because the, the thing is, it's not only, like those two yes, I'm interested in it, but then we, we Annette as well, like Annette was kind of covered a little bit with um, Eduna as well. So I'm just, bruh <laughs> there's so much that I, I, have, I have a lot of questions just in general. And then ultimately this will all come back to Klaus because Remember, this guy still is going through his situation because, especially because of how he lost um, his whole family, basically, including the father of that family that he saw, which was his mentor. So, like, he literally, from his point of view, he literally has no one. And I feel like it's, he's still going through, like, the grieving phase, which still goes into, because I wanted to see more, um, more focus on like the painting that he did because I thought like slowly like gradually slowly but surely the color did the color even change I see I don't even remember at that point 
but like as that thing as the story develops and they try to the the characters here like um Tomoshibi Tomoshibi he's not the I, I forgot their names honestly <laughs> the, the freaking group name so they like their group would eventually warm up to him and then they will get you know be like the the they won't be a replacement it's 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 far from a replacement you can never say that you, you would replace one's family you can never do that but in this case they can be a new family that he can that Klaus can think about I thought they were gonna go into that kind of situ you know that kind of route or some sort I don't know something like that even he himself said that he love is something that he cannot give but if it's family familial love and that's something else is what he said you know so oh where am i going with this i am giving a score of at least five would be too low five honestly five is too low it, it deserves a passing grade especially with how mind-blowing the whole situation was just just for each plot for each not plot each um arc that they went to like for each of the characters i'm I'm just a bit confused at how they paced out Greta's one because I know it, it is supposed to be an arc. It focuses on not only... Yes, it, it doesn't focus only on Greta, but it focuses on like other girls like Sylvie. It also kind of went through like Sarah as well because Greta was kind of helping and like talking to them as well in, in, her, in her own ways as Klaus. So I'm not... There's no, not much, it's not complaining. It's definitely not complaining. It's just that I'm very confused as to why it was switched, like, it was like that, you know? Yeah, see, Peach Boy Riverside, I get three or four. That was pretty low. And that was only for the opening, like, opening and ending song, because those were really good. So I was pretty harsh with the series. Like, a lot of people I know actually kind of dropped the series, because... They did not like how they were pacing it out. It was just a whole ass mess of a timeline. You would, you would, you thought that, like, you were getting somewhere, but then suddenly they go into the past before the whole situation even became to be, and then like you don't know where you are at this point. Like, who the fuck is this? Who the fuck are you? Like, what's going on? Here, at least they indicate where and when they are in like the timeline. So I give credit to that. That's like the basis of what you could possibly do. The other one, they, I don't know why, was they trying to add like some kind of suspense into it? They, it, it just honestly just ruined the whole flow of it. And it was just like, did I miss an episode or did I, did I watch the, like, is it the wrong order? The moment that you have to give the audience like an indication, especially if you're a starting series. If, if you're a long-running series, it's fine. But if you started with this series, like, it's your first season, it's it's a risky move. If you're trying to teach the viewers that there's a watching order for this so that you can understand what the hell's going on. I'm, I'm sorry to say it, but, like, viewers for, especially if they're first-time viewers, they're not going to be, they're not going to put the effort. I'm, I'm going to be straightforward. Like, it's, it's not that I'm saying that they're, like, Yes, some people, most most people, they can be lazy, but it's just that they don't have that connection. Unlike for like maybe like let's say light novel readers or manga readers, maybe they'll put in that dedication to like kind of like put it like to order it out and like watch it in that order that they know of. But newcomer, they have to be thinking that it's not only those people. Yes, it's targeted at them, but then ultimately they're trying to get more people to watch their not watch to read their original works. I. Again, I don't know why they did it. That was a big mistake on their line. This one, though, it's bordering on that line. It truly is. If I'm, I'm telling you, if they don't make a season two or like continue it, and let's say in season two they continue this, I don't know. I feel like it'll be a bit tricky for newcomers to continue this series. That's why I see like it's the score the average score is 6. A lot lower com for a, for something that was not 
I don't know. I don't know if it was. I I know a lot of people were very、um, excited for this to be animated. So they were like, oh, we we gotta watch this. We gotta watch it. But as soon as they continued to release the the, the episodes, a lot of people were just like, what what the fuck is going on? <laughs> so.、Uh, It's a lot better than a three or a four. It has to get above five. It can't be. It can't be eight or nine. Eight, nine, ten is out of out of its range. If it's just this season alone, there has, like, just to get maybe six point five, it has to. It has to get a second season. Also, that score will highly depend on how the second season rolls out. Um, five point five, I think, would be adequate. Just, just in general, because. Ah, guys, this—I don't know. It's just too much. It's just too much for me. I'm—I'm <laughs> I'm trying to think of it as much as like a positive kind of scenario, but like, eh. oh, I already wrote the recommendation list for this. <laughs> I'm gonna copy that. Okay, because I remember I wrote—I—I I was talking about like what I could recommend for the series. So here we are. Here we fucking are. Oh my god, it's already forty one minutes. Um, yeah, no, this is gonna be a long one because、uh, there's so much, not not a lot to say. It's just that I'm not, I'm just not happy with how this kind of went. Because, like, come on, Kadoka, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> They had so much potential in this. Not not only potential, like they're. Not a season two. My my bad. Let me. I kept on saying season two, season two because I'm used to saying season two. I I do apologize. I meant part two. At best, I feel like they will continue with a part two. Season two. I keep. See, this is a problem. They weren't. There weren't no. There there wasn't such things as part twos in the past. I'm gonna be straightforward and honest. They just went with like a season two, or they just stopped. It's either basically it came to like. Two situations, be it no, well,、uh, yeah, I'll I'll put it at two. Be it that they have like a proper season two, or they just give you OVAs, aka special episodes. So this could include include like a Blu-ray special edition of like a certain chap, like a special chapter, which is technically an OVA. Or they could do like different short special episodes, like episode one, two, three. But this is only covering like the point five, like the omake. Chapters in that series, so it doesn't really add on or like progress the plot, but it's just like additional stuff. OVAs will be like they kind of develop that further on by adding like special episodes, like episode if it's like a twelve episode series, then they'll they, they'll put, put like episode thirteen where they kind of add like that、um, extra oomph so that the peop the watchers could be somewhat satisfied with how fastly they just ended off the series. But I digress.、Um, this series, not nowadays, they're doing a lot of the part two so that they can kind of gauge like how much su- success I'm guessing the series would have. So that's why they don't do twenty four episodes as easily as they do in the past. Even in the past, they didn't do as much. But then they could see that if they Suddenly announce like a twenty-four episode series on the get-go, like in the beginning, it gets very difficult towards the end for people to like continue watching, and the hype kind of like isn't as high. Like even even for like the part one, part two things, it really depends on the people. Like for for Komi-san, you can see like there was a that one wasn't a part division kind of thing, but it was like a season thing, and you can see that there was like a big gap in like interest from season one and season two. When it comes to at least like the reaction, like a lot of people were going crazy for season one. Season two, I didn't see as much. I'm gonna be honest, it wasn't as big of a boom because there were obviously there were other series and such. But I I was actually surprised with like season two. Like I thought there would be more people in like hyped up for it. Nothing, just no. Okay, I'm like I'm like okay, whatever. But this series, um, I already have the list, so I'll I'll tell you what I recommend. So first off, Ansa Sekiyoshisu Assassination Classroom. This is like spot on. It's just the difference is that they have boys in that series, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, on the other hand, Koro Sensei is like a it's a brilliant teacher. Like he, 
is just literally good at everything at that point. <laughs> so there's Ansatsu Kyoshitsu. Bakato test is more of a lighter one where they don't really kill people, but they show like the whole synopsis of how um, the main characters there that are shown are like at the dirt bottom. Like they are um, outcasted by the school, by, by the whole system that they're in. Just like them, outcasted. It's shown to be failures, etc., etc. And then gradually and surely they go up to the top, etc. So that's why I was like, this is perfect for like Bakato test, Anzatsu no Kyoshisu. And then from there, Akuma no Rido kind of comes in here, where there's like all the girls, they're, they have their own specialties, their own tactics, and they're kind of not exactly the same when it comes to like who they're trying to kill or assassinate or like the plot line but like the setting of it is very similar that's why i put akuma no riddle and then when it comes to like going through each of their like struggles or not pet peeves but like their struggles their um traumas in this case i thought denpa kyoshi was interesting because there we can see like the teacher coming in and like helping them in this in this case and scenario you know so denpa kyoshi comes in as well and then Assassination's Pride, also with the whole like at the bottom, bottom tier and then rate like um, tutored and like raised to be like top tier kind of thing going on there. Nejima also as well, not exactly with like the bottom tier, problematic students maybe, but they're, it's more about like their uniqueness for each of the students in their own ways, just like them as well. So this, with, each of the series that I'm recommending now, they all have, all of the characters have very specific and special individualistic talents. That's why I, rec that's why I wholeheartedly recommend these series. So, and then the last one was Naka no Hito Genome. So this one also is more about, this one is a survival game where they actually bring in the concept of like YouTubers, like streamers are brought in here together and then they're kind of put into like a it's not a survival okay survival game is a bit too iffy it's not that it's not that they really die or anything. well the manga kind of goes into more deeper plot but they, like there's a there's a bigger picture when it comes to the series the anime did not obviously you had to stop they only had 12 ep 12 episodes I think 12 13 episodes it was a short series so um in that case here they kind of just go about um, looking at what specialties or like what special traits that they all have and what and looking at their strong uh, their strengths and their weaknesses and then from there they kind of work well as a team just like how they they work together. So again, Ansatsu Kyoshitsu, Bakato Test, Akuma no Rido, Denpa Kyoshi, Assassin's Pride, Nejima, Naka no Hitojeno. Assassin's Pride, kind of, yes special traits but it's more about the whole from the bottom to the top more related to that and the fact that there's like spies undercover agent kind of situation going on although this is more catered to like the assassins part of it as, as it says assassins pride so yeah um overall score 5.5 these are the recommendation recommendations recommendations that i give and i hope you enjoyed that i Drag this on for too long since 15 minutes. Um, I hope there's a second season. It better have a second season. If not, I'll be so mad. But yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Ciao.